So often for those that manage here, St. James's Park is a hard place. Enter now the Rock of the North, a man who knows above all others the way to a Geordie's heart. When they've worked all week, the match for them is a bit like the people down south going to a theatre. You know, they're going, they're going to be entertained. They, they, they've worked hard all week. The Messiah looks a little different 15 years on from his first coming as manager, but just like then, Newcastle is the only club for which he would have broken his retirement. By bringing Alan Shearer to the club for a world record transfer fee over a decade ago, King Kev proved he knew how to press the buttons of the St. James's Park faithful. And the door clearly is open to Shearer once more. I want to bring the very best to, to Newcastle United, and I think the answer to the question is if, if, if there's a role that Alan wants and that he's right, and that's the key, I would love to have him back here, yes. So you will talk to him at some stage? I definitely will talk to him, there's no doubt about that. At St James's Park, six managers have come and gone since Keegan's departure, and none of them have enhanced their careers here. It has become known as a devilishly difficult place to achieve real success, but no one has come closer in the modern era than Keegan. Kevin Keegan said he is the best qualified man for this job and that the expectation in this neck of the woods simply doesn't scare him. They are words that will remind the Newcastle United fans of just what they've been missing. I've got a feeling that he's going to sort the defence out and it's up the league we go, that's all I can say. It's just a dream come true. We need the heartbeat brought back to the club and this is the exact man to do it. Robson brought it back a little bit, but this man knows exactly where we need to be. Perfect man for the job. Keegan said he would support United's Joey Barton 100% as he faces his current courtroom difficulties. And on Michael Owen, who called Keegan's management of England a dark phase of his career, the new manager is hardly picking fights. I think he's entitled to his opinion. I'm looking forward to working with him. I don't have a problem with that. The United fans will delight in Keegan's return and his plan to bring in two or three players this transfer window. The visit of Bolton tomorrow.